Isaya Yamamoto was an Asian American author who is most known for her short stories, 17 syllables, and other stories. She unfortunately died in 2011 at the age of 89, a couple months before her 90th birthday, but her legacy still lives on. Isaya Yamamoto was born in Redondo Beach, California, to parents that are from the Nisei generation. When she was young, she had interest in reading and writing. She grew up during World War II, and especially with things like the bombing of Pearl Harbor, Asian Americans were often discriminated against during this time. As a result, Yamamoto and her family were put in an internment camp in Poston, Arizona. During this time, Yamamoto was writing for the Poston Chronicle, a newspaper at the camp, and since then her writing career started to take off. In the three years Asaya was there, she continued to write the past of time. After World War II, Yamamoto and her family were released from the internment camp, and she snagged a job as a writer for the Los Angeles Tribune. She received critical acclaim for her stories, and was fairly known by the public. In 1950, she became a mother of five and had less time on her hands. However, despite the lack of time she had on her hands, she still felt she needed to write. However, her most known story, 17 Syllables and Other Stories, is a collection of fictional stories that are based off her time in the internment camp, women's place in society, among other things, and the book was a moderate success. In the end, Yamamoto died in her sleep in 2011, but as I said before, her legacy still lives on.